The world shall taste my eggs. Well, mm. there are eggs. And then chicken. The chicken runs off. There's Aww. a fish. Chicken rides the fish. Makes it to the, makes it to the fair. <laughs> rides a teacup. <laughs> and uh. uses laser vision to decimate humans. Okay, what the hell was that? <laughs> welcome back to another episode of Game of Flavor. This is uh, Psychonauts, and we're about to go into our deepest, darkest fears. And fight an old diving helmet. Did you see uh, Raz's little? He started a little idol animation. Uh uh, I wasn't. No, I, he just got a little dance. There's a little dance. All right, let's. Little dancey dance. Let's watch his little dance. No, he didn't want to do it. Well, now that we're watching. He was like doing like the floss. <laughs> he was flossing. It looked like it. If this is where it started, that'd be amazing. Uh, I don't think it's gonna happen. Huh, weird. Oh! Oh my god, that's the thing? Oh, I tried to set it on fire, but it, like, blasted me back. Oh, that was it. Ah, done. Good for you. Well, that wasn't bad at all. I was just sitting there. Yeah, I never. Oh, go ahead. I was gonna say, I never even noticed you picked those tags up. I don't remember picking it up either. I just run over everything nearby. <laughs> meat! What kind of meat? Beef. There's a big ass steak. Hey, where'd it go? You don't have the cobweb no. thing, do you? No, I don't. I wish I did. Ooh. Is that your cat? Yeah. He's he's um <sighs> I love him. He is just a handful. I command you to stop. Dang. Is it just one or are they both kind of rambunctious? Uh, Rao's much quieter. Terry is like... <sighs> Sometimes he'll just like scream for no reason. He's fed, he's petted, he's held. He has a clean litter box, but he's still just a nightmare sometimes. Oh, I wonder if he needs some like stimulation. Well, I mean, yeah, we play with him. I don't, I don't really know. We've got a laser pointer and you know, cat toys and all sorts of stuff, but... It's a chatterbox. Yeah, he just sometimes he's like, You're not paying attention to me! <laughs> but he, you know, he's a tiny little cat, so he's more like... <laughs> Maybe he's having an existential crisis. No, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Existence is pain! I don't know. Cat life seems so luxurious to me. Oh, I know, right? Just doing nothing, getting fed, taking big honking shits that someone else <laughs> cleans up. Sign me up for reincarnation as a cat. I'm hearing a crying piece of luggage. Where could it be? Oh, I 
hear it. It's near. I think I passed it, but I don't know where. Oh well. Oh, there it is. Ah. It's got quite the projection. <laughs> oh, don't mind me. Move, move. Oh, thank you. You didn't have to do that. Fire! Oh my god, what have I done? <laughs> they even say ow. <laughs> <laughs> they have feelings. those things. Oh good, another tag. Do you think those creatures have consciousness or individuality, anything like that? I imagine not. It's probably just like a like, it's just a representation of, I don't know, like, chemicals in your brain or whatever. Okay. Uh, oh, what is his voice? Oh, uh, what am I supposed to do with that? Leave it. <laughs> yeah. Little boy. I am sorry Little to say button. that you have a very serious mental problem. <laughs> the trouble originates in this area. Here, the area that we in the medical profession like to refer to as the brain. <laughs> you see, son, it's just no good. I hate to be so blunt, but... Oh, now, talking about Tim Burton, he looks like the scientist from uh, Nightmare Before know, Christmas. Oh, yeah. You are always saying that. What do you think's wrong with my brain, Doctor? How should I know? I'm a dentist! <laughs> Guess what I do know. If a tooth is bad, you pull it! But my teeth are fine. Yep! Mad <coughs> brain's got to come out, boy! It's the quickest way to cure what you've got! Oh my and god. Of the mind. But I don't wanna! Sh -sh 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 -sh. Now hold still. This will only hurt until your brains come flying out. Don't worry, Dogen. I'm coming up there to save you. Oh my god. No time to explain, Sasha. I gotta climb the spooky thorn tower. I am going to murder that psycho dentist. I, uh, he's actually, spoiler alert, the main protagonist in this. If you didn't pick up on that. Uh, antagonist like the villain? Yes. He does seem like he would be an excellent one. He's scary as all hell. <laughs> I'm just getting so much emotional baggage dealt with today. It's a good self-care day. What is this? Oh, it's a diving helmet. Maximum projection or, or depth. Or it's not. <laughs> what is projection depth again? It's um, when you run out of layers of projection depth, you can't sustain your astral projection oh. and you get booted out. So it's like max health. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Alright, get, the, get back here. Please, just, I want to help you. I want to help you! The world shall taste my eggs. Well... Mm. There are eggs. And then chicken. The chicken runs off. There's Aww. a fish. Chicken rides the fish. Makes it to the, makes it to the fair. <laughs> rides a <the> teacup. <laughs> and uh. uses laser vision to decimate humans 
Okay, what the hell was that? <laughs> I'm seeing some crazy <laughs> stuff in here, Sasha. This can't be right. Ugh, why did I buy the cheap brain tumbler? <laughs> so that... <laughs> oh. I, I would be worried about what this would do to my brain. Like, any kind of side effects after this. I think you're supposed to be, like, clearing your brain out, though, right? Because, um, uh, the first time you had that monster, clearly, like, something had been... There's no way to get any higher. You must use your levitation power. I don't know how to levitate. Oh, well, here you go. I had no idea you were at such a remedial level. Hey. Lucky for you, we have one of the world's foremost levitators on staff. Agent Mia Vodello. The oh, this is a fun one. Precisely. The mental minx. badge to reach her at the docks. Oh, I get a boat. Determine where this interference is coming from. Return when you've earned your levitation merit badge. So, like, I wonder, is this the main quest, and then you go off to get power ups to go back and do the main quest? Oh, you cl uh, it's time to go to the lake. Kinda yes, like this is the main quest right now. Okay. So far, we have to handle yourself. Oh my God! Are you okay? I had the strangest machine-induced dream about you. TV. Well, first of all, Sasha Nine invited me down to a secret the lab and bottom TV. Oh no. Oh no. He's completely brainless. The dream was true. Dogen, don't worry. I know what your brains are. They're in like this crazy dream thorn bush straight jacket tower place. <laughs> you go to the TV lounge. I'm on the case. I just need a little more advanced training to prepare. I'm gonna trust him to find his way. I mean he waddled out of a lake, so I guess he's <laughs> We don't have to worry about him having to breathe. You know, you could probably stop by the shop and buy some stuff too. Oh yeah, I'm gonna do that because I need those uh, cobweb cleaners. Check it out, Admiral. I'm an oarsman, first class. Hey, it looks like all those weeks in the canoe simulator really paid off. Uh, no yes, way. sir, Admiral, sir. <laughs> well, let's get you afloat. Finest of the fleet. I'll take good care of her, sir. That lake isn't as peaceful or as harmless as she looks. <laughs> now, don't take her out too far. This kid's wearing bell bottoms, isn't he? Don't. Yeah. God, I haven't seen bell bottoms. You're better than us because you can swim. This kid. And he's going to be here tomorrow to pick you up. My father? Oh, gotta go. The race is starting. Lily. Oh, hey, Raz. Listen, I made you something. It's kind of stupid, but... They stole Dogen's brains. No, he's just like that. <laughs> I had a nightmare where this mad scientist guy said he was gonna take them out. And was it a creepy looking freak with a shower cap and a stainless steel three pronged claw? Hey, that's my nightmare. So it's not just me. But how? And why all the meat? I don't know. But I think it's time I find out where this is coming from. Let's rendezvous tonight at the old boathouse for debriefing. This is so cool. Yeah, it feels like that time in True Psychic Tales 314 where... Shut up! Well, I guess that's... She's better at boating than you. <laughs> she is really fast. Is that like, um, I guess 
the Nancy Drew novels or the Hardy Boys? Yeah, probably. I think this guy's having a seizure. I have been ordered to report here for levitation training. I've already done the coach's obstacle course, and Sasha showed me how to shoot. You know, I'd expect that sort of recklessness from Orso, but Sasha? Agent 9 said you were the most powerful levitator the Psychonauts had. Sasha said that? Really? I didn't know he noticed. Well, you know, I only work with the best teachers. Huh. Flirt. Okay, let's party. <laughs> let's party. <laughs> 